say in the society, MS can strike just when you're starting to live. And Anita and Jan here have learned that, they've learned it firsthand. But they've got the, what we call the never quit attitude and survivor spirit. And they're determined to live as normal lives as, as they possibly can. These people symbolize the guts of all Americans faced with danger, affliction, and harm. And you yourself uh, know a little bit about that. Matter of fact, you're a shining example of it. As someone who's been there and knows what it's like. So from the MS people, wherever you are, here's a little something that tells you how proud we all are of you and how you make each of us proud to be an American. And this is the gift, Mr. President. It's a replica of a Remington, and its inscription reads, to the American and the White House, our president, who has straddled courage and rides it hard, an inspiration, <coughs> an inspiration to all of us in the multiple cirrhosis society and patients that served in 1981. If you, if or if you have one, I'll go through that door and to the right. Uh, Dan, will be. Wait, wait, I'll call. Well, the, Frank, I'm de delighted and very proud to have this. And I think it's kind of significant that Remington, the great artist, came to the West himself in search of help. Uh, so I'm delighted to have this, but delighted also that I have the honor of presenting the Father of the Year of the Multiple Sclerosis Society and the Mother of the Year. And so I'm very proud to present to coach Jan Robert Smith this award in recognition of his outstanding courage and leadership. Thanks so much. You're more than welcome. And now to Anita Wagner, again for outstanding courage and leadership, the mother of the year. These two are an inspiration to the 500,000 sufferers from multiple sclerosis that we have in our country. This is a ceremony that I'm proud to say has taken place here at the White House uh, every year that we've had these awards. Frank is the chairman of the Hope Chest Drive that takes place at this time every year. Last year raised $29 million. There have been $57 million already spent in the research uh, in this particular disease. And uh, I hope that the custom will continue until one day Hopefully, because of the efforts of people like these, there won't be any need for it uh, anymore. Coach, uh, played some football myself, but lately I found a few problems here that you might teach me some additional <laughs> things in tackling that <laughs> I could use. <laughs> and, uh, 